Earlier this year, I went to the Northwest Highlands of Scotland in January to be precise. Now, as many of you know that watch my vlog, you'll know that January in Northwest Scotland can be very cold. Even if it's zero, it certainly seems to feel a lot colder out there. So I reached out to a company called Valorette who make these wonderful Markov 2 Pro gloves. They kept my hands warm in, in that particular environment. But in March this year, I was headed off to Western Mongolia, the Altai region. So as a lot of you might think when you think of Mongolia of eagle hunters and big mountains, that's Western Mongolia, more Kazakh than actual Mongolia itself. Mongolia has an average altitude of around 1400 meters, but in the West, in the Altai region, it's more 1800 meters as an average altitude. March is spring, but certainly the the temperature that you have in that particular area of Mongolia is certainly anything but spring. You're likely to come across temperatures such as I did of around minus 15 or so. Now unlike Western Europe where you have a humid cold, the cold in Mongolia is a dry cold, but certainly if you get it, uh, the wind blowing out there, it certainly feels that minus 15 that I had. So what do you do? Well, I reached out to Valorette again because I saw they did a different glove. They do something called an overglove. It's called the Alta Overmit. And this is that glove. So they're very, very nice. They're very warm. And what I wanted to do when I was over there is just see how I got on with them. And I didn't film when I was over there actually using the glove. So I wanted to wait and just see how my trip went. But as you can see, they look big and they look bulky. But the thing is, do they do the job? And the answer is, yes, they do do the job. Now, I'm not going to lie to you and say that things are very simple to use when you have these gloves on, but that's why there's a zip here that you can undo your glove and you can actually get to your original glove underneath so you can get to the controls of your camera. Again, it's still not maybe as simple as you might think, but the problem is, is when you're dealing with a cold and certainly here in where I am right now in Japan in the Fuji Five Lakes area. It's a little bit chilly today, as you can see with all the snow. It's never going to be that easy when you're having to keep yourself and your extremities warm. What can you do about it? Not a lot, but certainly these outer overmit, they do provide a solution to a problem. Now the gloves themselves are very well made. And again, because it's by Valorette, they're by photographers for photographers. They come with this harness. So if you need to take your gloves off, you can just take them off quickly to get your original gloves and they're not dropping off on the floor. You still have access to get your gloves back on quickly should you need to keep your hands warm again. So as I said, here in Japan, it's starting to feel just a little bit chilly with all the snow. Not really what I expected in mid-April. But in any case, as I said, they're very well made. Like the, the Markov, you can actually take the glove off. You can peel it back and there's a clip there. So you, it's there and it's held in place so your fingers are free to do as you please. As I said, there is a zip there as well. So even with the thickness of the gloves, you can still undo them to get your original gloves underneath. And then you can control your camera. As I said, it is still a little bit tricky with the gloves like this. But what do you want to do? If you're working in harsh environments, you're going to have to have some difficulties in working. It's never going to be that simple. Would I recommend these gloves to you? I would thoroughly and wholeheartedly say that these Alta Overmits definitely do the job that they say they do. They're easy to order on the Valorette website. There's no problems there. One thing that I will mention is my regular gloves here, these Markov 2 Pros, they're a medium size. So what Valorette say is basically order the same size for your Alta Overmit. And as you'll see, they just very easily slip on and slip off again. So there you go. That's the Alta Overmit from Valorette. Are they worth it? Definitely. I would certainly recommend it to people who are in harsh environments like I experienced in the Altai of Western Mongolia.